Hey everybody, how's it going? Today we're going to be playing some Fortnite. I thought it'd be a fun idea to do some relaxing Fortnite gameplay because this season is very relaxing. That's, that's my first impression of this season is that it's just meant to be more casual and relaxing, you know? Nothing to be too concerned about. And then this Hulk with the crabs, the crab gauntlet things. I had to show him my Codsworth. Here we are on the battle bus. Battle bus. Battle bus. Where should we go? Let's go to Sandy steeps or steps I don't know how to say it what is your favorite place to drop this season I really still like Grimgate Grimgate is nice as you can see I have my favorite skin Boogeyman. Love Boogeyman. 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 I like the purple. And obviously it's fitting because he's a rabbit. I tried to land at this purple house with hope in it, but someone else ran up. So I decided to land over at this chest, looking for some good loot. Got a crossbow, not too bad. Grab the shotgun, and I'm gonna panic my way over to the Jeep. Mm-hmm. Get some shield. Wee. I like the nitro. I like it better than the slap because you can run into stuff. It's fun. I thought the medallion would be over here, but it's not. And then I got caught in some crossfire. So I had to show him. My shotgun. And there we go. I found some minis. I'd like something with some distance. So I grabbed that. Grab the Stealthy Spotter Enforcer AR. Stealthy Spotter Enforcer AR. How'd my car get over there? Let me get back in and keep on going. And I know there's some vehicle upgrades, but I gotta get the gold. Yay. Now we upgrade. But then, footsteps. So we gotta go. We gotta run. What do you guys think of the vehicles this season? Do you think they're annoying? Do you think they're fun? Do you think they're necessary? Or not so necessary? Let me know down below in the comments. Just head out of this general area. But first, I need to heal my car at the gas station. Mm hmm. It's a bit hard to drive on rocks, but we got it. I'm not used to 
PC controls. So I was trying to figure out how to turn off the radio and how to switch seats. It was fun. Mm. up towards this way and I spot someone gonna get my grenade launcher out show him who's boss but this one this guy is pretty good he gets in my car and steals it and I said no way Jose no way Jose try to get him I miss sweet push forward and then he gets up there I said no way Jose and so I shoot the bush but then he goes out of the bush but can't escape all of for too long gotcha got him with the grenade launcher grenade launcher then someone else shoots at me, and so I do the only appropriate thing. I slam the gas, and then my grenade launcher. But then another car comes up, and I say, no way, Jose. No way, Jose. So I'm out. And then they start shooting crossbows at me. I said, no way, Jose. Super no way. I didn't mean to hit those off-road tires. I like the bulletproof tires a lot better. But it will suffice. I grab a cow catcher, grab some minis, and we're out of here. They keep shooting me. And yet again, I say no way, Jose. Ooh, turtle flip. Whee! We keep on keeping on. I didn't want to go in the nitro dome. Because there was a lot of people that I didn't want to have to deal with. So off I go. Into this tunnel. Because they can't shoot me. And then I see these guys. I said, yes, this will be perfect. I'm gonna use my grenade launcher. Grenade launcher. Grenade launcher. <laughs> and there we go. And after all that crossbow fire, I got a little paranoid and decided to put a shield bubble. Grab my forecast card, off to the, the tower. And there we go. Now, with this intel, surely I'll be able to win, right? You would think so. back in my car and I keep going keep making my way towards this gas station hello how's it going I love my car And then make my way towards Grimgate or the Underworld. Grab the bulletproof tires, finally. Much better than the off-road tires, in my opinion. Grab some of this dash water, whatever you want to call it. What do you guys think of the tires? 
which one's better, off-road or bulletproof? Let me know what you think. And I wanted to know if Cerberus was still here, but then I start getting shot at by none other than the Fallout laser rifle. So I had to take that for myself. Goodbye. Let's go collect our booty. I was already full on minis, but I grabbed that, and I keep on keeping on. 18 players left, I'm doing pretty good. I wonder if there's anyone else I can shoot with my grenade launcher. And I see the chosen gun, the gatekeeper. I said, I have to have a gatekeeper. So I guess I'll switch out my crossbow. Good enough. Off we go. But then I see it. Could it be a Nuka Cola? Fresh from the wasteland. And then I see a chest, and so I go for it. Hmm, ammunition. Yum, yum, yum. Whee! And then I head back towards point. I want to head towards the windmill, and so naturally I boost off the cliff and drive through lakes to get there and boost up the side of a near 90 degree angle. Thank you Fortnite physics. Scope in the area, but then I get a shot. I said, no way, Jose. No way, Jose. I'm out. Out of here. Not before healing my car. But then, I see someone. Oh, yes. I can shoot them with my grenade launcher. Almost got him, but I didn't get him all the way. So I keep going. And I see people fighting over a bunker. I think, yes, if I can get these people, I can get the bunker. So I'll ram them and I'll use my grenade launcher. Is that a good trigger? Didn't but then they blow up my car. So I said, I guess I'm on foot now. Oh well. And then I see the golden gatekeeper. I try to edit, but there's someone behind me. So I said, no way, Jose. No way, Jose, I'm out. Just so they don't see me. And then wha pow. 14 damage. Tried to shoot him, but he was too far. And so I thought I'd follow. Get back here. I gotta show you my cool new gatekeeper. But then 
just there shooting with the crossbow and so I think it's Nuka Cola time. Save the cap. And there we go. And this is where it all goes downhill. Ironically, as I'm going uphill. Here they are. Taste my gatekeeper. And then I died. Oh well. It was a good game. Congratulations, local halfwit. Special thanks to my Beanie Bro subscribers on Patreon. You are Azami Okami, Enigmatic Elm, Bla the Nico, White 1990, Mind of Centel, August, Tuvan Luhau, Alex the Sphinx, and Oblivion Child. I love you all. Have a good night.